Hi! Welcome back to Hat in Time. Hello. We're gonna finish up the Arctic Cruise. The ship's gonna sink. There's there's only three acts. The ship literally cannot sink. It will sink. Rock the boat! <laughs> <laughs> it literally can't sink. Excuse me? See? It's fine. Uh, uh... For now. Hmm? Right here. On the boat. Okay. Guess we're on the boat. Do I not look busy to you, pup? Go play somewhere. Let an old captain relax. The seals can handle things for a minute. Hopefully they've learned not to mess with the steering wheel by now. <laughs> oh no. Uh, Alright, let's... Let's go. You gonna mess with the steering wheel? First. Look at the big shiny thing. Well, I wonder what that is. That looks... I think it's a timepiece based on the last level having that be the indicator for a timepiece existing. Hat Kid was gonna kill everyone on this ship just for a timepiece. Imagine if that wasn't a timepiece and Hat Kid just like kills hundreds for nothing. I don't think there's hundreds of people on this ship. Do seals not count as people? I still don't think there's hundreds even if you count all the seals. Count was at least a hundred. Yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Headed, headed to the captain's room for no particular reason. <laughs> Taking the long way. Don't do it. Yeah, this is the long way. I don't know why I took this route. Oh. I'm gonna sit in the captain's chair. Don't do it. Don't do it. Okay. okay. Immediately crash the ship. We did it. Okay. Don't worry, it literally can't sink. Hack <laughs> it, you're a fucking psychopath, what? <laughs> I'm, yeah. I'm going to write a very strong post on Twitter about this. <laughs> Call out post on Hack Kid. Well, this seems okay. Was it worth it? How many people just die? Going down, pup. Never thought I'd see the day. We're making voyage too. Won't take more than a few minutes for all this to hit the sea floor, I think. Well, you might want to get to a lifeboat, pup. It'd be smart. We've gone into the ship instead of doing the thing that would be smart because there's people who need rescuing. You, you just. Why did you do this? You nearly killed these children. And now I'm saving them. I understand the consequences of my actions. This is fucked up. Also, I hope you like the uh, carrying stuff mechanic from Ship Shape because it's back. Oh my god. You this can do this in multiple trips if you want, since there's no timer or anything, and it'll make it a little bit easier, but... I'm not gonna do that. I gotta get them all now. Yeah, the ship's sinking. Yeah. Nice damage boost. Someone should turn this up, it's off. <laughs> I guess it doesn't matter at this point, but... They're trying it in the water. Okay, yeah, that's fair. I think Hacky should be tried for this. Yeah. Also, as you can see here, the water's cold. Don't go in the water, it's really cold. Yeah, the I really hope you go to Nuremberg for this. The ending of Titanic taught me that. So This water is electrified. Don't go in it either. Is the octopus okay? Uh -huh. He'll be fine. Don't worry about it. It's not, yeah, I'm sure. It's not like you just kill a lot of people. Yeah, the octopus will be fine. Like They belong in the sea. They're from the sea. It's an electric octopus. Yeah? It doesn't belong in the fucking Antarctic Ocean. What? He's gonna die. <laughs> Aren't all oceans the same? No! no. Oh no, I made a great mistake. <laughs> Bokid would never do that. Never got to inform you that Bokid did this at my second playthrough on Bokid. Fuck. The first Bokid wouldn't do this. Yeah. <laughs> the first Bokid. 
What's the name of my next indie game? <laughs> Immediately Bo gets Prime. sued by Cares for Breakfast. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, we made it back. I really like this level because, like, it's the same level that you've been in, but tilted really weird, and I think it's cool and creative and interesting to platform through the areas. Yeah, it's generally really cool. It's just also really fucked up that you just kill a lot of <laughs> No one has died. <laughs> Have you All seen right. a single corpse? This is a tragedy entirely of your own making. Yeah, that's okay. I'm helping fix it. I just didn't think things through before I did that. Snatcher fucking drowns. <laughs> now that you mention it, I have not seen Snatcher anywhere. <laughs> in a fucking box in the hold. Poor Snatcher. Doesn't even have his fucking book anymore. Mm hmm. Nothing. So I do. don't think this is, like, the intended way to do this, but it's fine. <laughs> it works. There's, like, multiple different ways to go through the second half. Ouch. Look, I even saved the Mafia boss. He's gonna leave him, there's, like, there's a rift token. <laughs> ha! I can roll for gotcha now. Yeah. Drop these guys off since the boat's right here. Anyway, I will cancel hack it. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't take the most efficient route through here. And also, I don't think you're supposed to do this, but I did it anyway. What? Because I got a little bit lost. <laughs> <laughs> instead I of, mean, it worked. Instead of helping the drowning <laughs> victims hack, you just fucking parkours on an iceberg. Whoa, you're like pretty strong, huh? Oh my god. <laughs> god. Yeah. I went and picked him up and then realized, oh, the, that trail of pods is probably the way I was supposed to jump over here instead of that weird wall jump thing I did. Oh, well. <laughs> There's one more. Yeah, just one more. Very cold. Yep. No, they're right here. It's the conductor. <laughs> Scott's just standing there. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he can't jump. Actually, he can. I've seen his boss fight. Yeah. <laughs> he could get out of here fine. Yeah. Don't wait up for me, pup. Get in a boat and scram. This is my dang ship, and I'll go down with it. Oh my god! <laughs> He's the captain. Yeah, it's kind of yeah, fair. The time limit here, the time limit here isn't the ship sinking since so a ship this size would take hours to sink. The time limit is the conductor gets impatient and leaves. Right next to a sinking ship is a terrible place to be, though. You will get yeah. pulled under by it. Hey, he, his fucking kids are in that boat. What do you want from him? Yeah, that's fair. Also, this is your fault. That too. For once, the conductor may be in the right. <laughs> <laughs> Under no circumstance do you have to hand it to the conductor. I don't like that the clock is still ticking. Put me down, pup. You get more time, at least. Oh, okay. Like, it's a new time limit once you pick him up. It's a generous time limit as long as you don't get lost. Do you get lost? Let go of me. Are you lost? Me be, pup. 
No, I know my way around. All right. Also, I say it's a generous timeline, but it actually isn't that generous in hindsight. Like, come to think of it, it's generous if you're a gamer. Why is that steel still here? Got to show the way. Yeah. No. There's a lot. Of, there's seals in the uh, inner tubes in there too. How are you so strong? I'm sure they'll be fine. They're seals. Seals are good at water. Yeah, they are actually made for this environment, so they'll probably be okay. Yeah. I, I, I don't actually know that a seal would survive being inside of a sinking cruise ship, but you know. <laughs> Just leave. Do they have it? Yeah, they could. Pretty easy. Yeah. 18 seconds to spare. Oh, pup. Why wouldn't you just let me go down with my ship? I can't drown, but at least I could pretend for a bit. <clears throat> Although, without me, this crew will never be able to get the lifeboats to shore. Fine. Crew, let's go home. Thank you, miss. Like, thanks, dudette. I totally didn't see this coming. Hey, thank you, lass. The little ones haven't learned to swim yet. Hopefully our insurance covers this. Anyway, I can't give out refunds, but it looks like there's something shiny on that iceberg over there. Huh. Funny how our ship crashed right next to it. It's all yours, pup. Also, the, uh, the captain is wrong. Walruses can, in fact, drown. <laughs> they... They don't have gills. <laughs> I mean, he'd be, he'd be fine anyways. He can swim, you see. Yeah, he probably could have gotten out of it. Anyway, that's the Arctic Cruise. There are time rifts, though, that we're gonna take care of while we're here. I would simply swim. Yeah. Oh, we still have a lot of... Oh. This one took hey. a lot of relics. It's been a while since we saw a new purple rift. Mm-hmm. Cake museum. Can't reach ones on the top shelf. Short little lady. Yeah. Wait, right, there are two time rifts here. One purple and one blue. I believe we do the blue one first, but I haven't watched this video in a little bit that <laughs> I recorded a while ago. That's a really short act, or chapter. Yeah. Well, it came with Death Wish, so mm -hmm. that's yeah. probably why. Also, it's a big oh, yeah. ship. Here's the blue one. It's up here. Oh! This might actually be my favorite blue tie rift of the game. It's a really fun one. It's got a good gimmick. Yeah, you just kill all the passengers for some reason. So. <laughs> yeah. It's a gimmick that it has everything. Oh my god. Here we go. Looks like it has everything. It does have a lot of mechanics. Oh, the gimmick sliding. is sliding. <laughs> <laughs> really useful, Mario really Sunshine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Also, I recommend equipping the no bonk badge for this because otherwise you'll often bonk your head trying to uh, go through the little like guard walls. Uh, it's just smoother and more exciting if you use the no bonk badge. Fair enough. It's kind of funny though. Hmm. All right, now it gets serious. Uh oh. Oh shit. Platforming God. This took me a few tries, and every time I had to run back to it on the ship. <laughs> you can also use the time stop hat there, which I think is the intent, but I didn't. Use the hat. This is another one where the time stop hat would probably help you a little bit because the timing is tight. Use the hat. Nope. It's amazing. That for part the hat. is it's really okay. fun. So I don't know if this is made for the time stop hat. It's all perfectly easy without it. 
It's not like cheating the race, where you're specifically told not to go in there unless you have the time stop at. Yeah, that's it though. Oh. It's also one of the longer blue riffs. Yeah. Like, there's still only a couple minutes, but they're normally really short. It is DLC. Yeah. Now we get to go do the purple rift after we roll the slots. Oh boy. What do we get? What do we get? Oh, that looks cute. It's a panda squid. Pretty Weird. good. I like it. Yeah. Are there real life panda squids? I don't think that's a real thing. Jesse, I want you to ask yourself that again. I asked it out loud once and I'll ask it again. Hmm. Right, now we're gonna do the purple rift, which is right on the docks. Very easy to get to. Nice. <laughs> you gotta skip his intro there. <laughs> also, past. over here, this is one of the two places that shock squids appear in the game. What? <laughs> one of the three spots. Okay. And the third one is in this time rift. Oh. So of the three places that they show up, two of them are DLC. Okay. <laughs> and the Place. other one is the subcon purple rift for some reason. <laughs> so the deep sea time rift is generally regarded as the hardest non-death wish thing in the game. Okay. Mm. A lot of people have all, have quite a bit of trouble with the deep sea time rift, like for casual players who aren't in it for the death wish nonsense. What? This is a significant jump up in difficulty from most of the rest of the game. What's so hard about it? It's, it's kind of long and there's a lot of opportunities to hurt yourself and since the purple time rifts don't have checkpoints, you just have to make it all the way through and if you take too much damage, you have to start over. Oh... Um. Lots of room for error. Yeah. Like, there's no one individual part that's really hard. It's just... It's a lot to get through. And no checkpoints. I'm glad the Forest Dweller mask is getting used. Yeah. I like the starfish platform. Yeah, me too. I like the terrible squishing noise they make when you step on them. <laughs> like the whole vibe of this place. It's cool. Yeah, I like the deep sea rift a lot. Yeah, this is nice. Also, there's owls here for some reason. Oh. I'm not oh. sure why there's express owls in the deep sea rift, but I guess they were passengers on the boat, so... Yeah? Good enough. There's also that one island there with the big cat-shaped rock on it. it has cats. Aww. Like the the thief cats. Oh, <laughs> never mind. Yeah, like I was that. careful not to trigger them because I hate them. Fair enough. They suck. Yeah, they they're awful. The one bad cat. Mm -hmm. Squish. <laughs> I also really like how time rifts the uh, music, like how it kind of changes as you at each floor. Nice. It's a nice effect. And they all have that, but it's really noticeable in this one. Yeah. I like the aesthetics of this place a lot. Mm -hmm. I like... A lot of the stuff, like the structures, are very, like, bottom of a goldfish bowl. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And there's spot three. Oh! We won't be seeing these guys again. Okay. Bye. Ac actually, they are in one deathfish. They are in the rift collapse of the deep sea rift. <laughs> Same thing. Yeah, it's the same thing. It doesn't count. Sorry, they'll be mirrored. Yeah, that's true. They will be mirrored. What if they forgot to mirror their own like DLC for Rift Collapse? That'd be pretty good. They just get comments on the Steam page. Hey, you forgot to mirror this. <laughs> 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 All right. 
this is a rude one because it's in a chest so you can't see like the big glow effect on it uh, that makes it super obvious where it is Trixie. that's also not something they really do outside of the deep sea rift it's just kind of another thing that makes this a little bit mean oh just a dick move mm-hmm And you didn't need you could to pull that up. No, I didn't. You could probably guess that these things hurt you if you touch them. They're pokey. Mm -hmm. They love making you uh, do like run up a wall and jump off to hit a platform behind you. Yeah, this uh, rift really likes that. Yeah, but it's cool, so who cares? Yeah, it is cool and it feels satisfying to pull off. I forgot to switch the ice hat, so I threw a potion. <laughs> this is also a very long time rift, which is part of the difficulty as well, since, you know, again, no checkpoints. It's another sneaky one, but it's just a pawn, so it's not as big a deal if you miss it. One nice thing is if you're not trying to, like, do all of it to say, show it off for a video. Oh, wait, there's another one. Uh, oh. Oh! Ashley was wrong. Eh. Yeah, if you're just trying to get through it and not, like, collect everything, the there's a lot more pawns than you need, like, more so than any other time rift, so you can really get through it and skip a lot of the harder bits. That's kind of nice. Uh-oh, the cats. cats. <laughs> Damn, cat. I always forget that cat. I forgot that cat until it just stole from me. <laughs> <laughs> can tell because there's paws on the ground. Mm hmm. There are visual indicators to, to kind of tell you, like, hey, watch out for cats, but if you don't notice them, then they're quite a shock when it happens. But that also applies to real life. <laughs> yeah, if you don't, like, if you're not on the lookout for cats and one just, like, jumps on you, it's very scary. Yeah. I've had a cat just kind of jump up on me in the background, yeah. Like, while I'm playing a video game, a cat just jumps on my chair. It's spooky. I've got a friend who, uh, whose cat regularly jumps in her lap while she's in VR and scares the hell out of her. <laughs> Blow up the barrel. Can we, can we get a cat update? What? Uh, cat Spurs update. is on the bed. Okay. Pretzel's not in the room. Yeah, we... that's the that's the cat update right Fan now. Fan favorite pretzel. Everyone loves pretzel. Cat update. Friend of the show. It's not a segment. You can't yeah, just... it is. Well, it can be now. This is another sneaky one in a chest, oh. hidden like back behind everything. That's mean. It's hard to find all the pages here. Younger me would be like furiously typing up on Google, "Where the fuck are the storybook pages?" <laughs> I need the, I need the lore for the walrus man so I kind of skipped a bunch there not quite on purpose but it worked out that was a Super Mario 64 speedrun trick it yeah. kind of was <laughs> I damage boosted my way up also we could just leave right now we have everything but I want to show off the other pawns in this floor <laughs> oh Ashley I mean, I, I gotta show it. It's it's a let's play. How oh, dare you, oh, Ashley? This is rude because like the timing is a little strict with the dweller mask combined with the spinning platform. I like how this looks. This is cool. Yeah, I like it too. This in particular, for some reason, reminds me of Galaxy. Like this particular. Yeah, uh, yeah I could see yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Galaxy kind of liked its conflicting environment, where it would like yeah. put fire in an ice level and stuff. It was neat. Mm. Also, this floor is where it becomes really apparent that this is like a brutally hard time rift compared to the rest of the game. Yeah, that definitely mm -hmm. was way harder than whatever the game has shown thus far. But if you're diligent about uh, diligent about collecting pawns on the prior floors, then you could just skip this entire really really difficult one. But what if you're digital? Uh, I'm not sure about that one. Okay. Sucks to be you, then. Yeah. Oh, here's a here's a rude one. 
Oh, God. Oh, yes. That's fun. Ooh. I like that. That's fun. There's also a uh, collapsing platform that you can jump onto if you don't have Fast Hatter equipped while you wait for the cooldown. But it's way cooler if you equip Fast Hatter and just do it all in one swift motion. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oops. Oh, jeez. That one's a little hard. I got it spinning a rook. Mm hmm. Alright. Yeah, we did it. Did it. We, we did it. Alright, show me the seal lore. Show me the lore. Why are they littles? It's not I gonna be I answer. don't think the lore is gonna tell us about that. Tell me. Stop. Give me the answers don't, I see. Don't raise your expectations too high. <laughs> Lore that explains why all the seals are painfully baby. <laughs> uh, hey, you did it. That's the Arctic Cruise done. Alright. Yeah, whole thing. Yeah. We'll never see it again. 100%. Alright, here's our lore. Oh. Me. Alright. Boat. <laughs> Aww. Aww. No. Oh. Oh my God. Yep. Anyway, let's roll the slots. <laughs> Holy this, shit! This is bullshit. Fuck this Elfie! I really like how immediately after that super depressing storybook, just the fucking slot machine comes in and the excited happy music plays. Oh my god! It's like... Yeah, we're linked now. What the fuck though? What? Yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> it's cut out of nowhere. You think becoming Linkle can help <laughs> dull the pain? It can't. <laughs> the video's over too, we ended on that note. What the, what the fuck? fuck?